hello what a what a day i i really don't even know how to even explain how the day is gone but it's been a disaster it's been very frustrating but we're here I, i'm very curious to see how this game will be i'm definitely gonna change the position of this because that's my for my camera for when i record uh stuff on nascar 21 so gotta reposition that a little bit there we go so yeah we're 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 ready about as ready as i can be so all we're doing at the moment is just waiting for this to load it's almost done i should have done this last night and did all this sort of stuff today but from like 2 p.m to 7 or basically since noon i so much so much has gone on so much wrong I wake my mom up uh, at noon because I'm like, you know, let's go to the roadhouse because I wanted that to be a Christmas present and the treat will be on me. I wanted to get there at 3 to get everything situated so she can do other stuff, but things kept getting delayed. Something happened with her Amazon. Spammers were trying to spam, like, her hackers were trying to spam her account saying she spent, like, $700 on something, but that wasn't the case. It was just all just fake and it's just all, all, all a whole bunch of, of stuff. So, yeah, just it did it just it just didn't need to be this big of a a project. But anyways, we'll see what this game can do and see what the the hype's all about. So, we'll play. I'll definitely adjust the volume if I need to adjust it because I don't really know what to do with the volume. So. I, I the only thing I know about this game is just it's in a school setting and it's a visual novel like with uh, the story so that's like the only things I know I don't really know anything else other than those two aspects so I'm going into this like 95% blind so this would be a whole adventure kind of just to see what uh what this is all about. If I was a disaster, I mean, it's just, I was just trying to get things done early. But the, the shit with the Amazon trying to hack mom's account or somebody trying to hack into it. When it wasn't the case, um, just her trying to get done so we can leave. Um, it, it just, it just made the day really long just trying to do stuff. I never really had a thing where I'm trying to do something nice for someone and it just turns into a really stressful ordeal. It's I don't even know how to explain it. It's just it's just very frustrating. But I just got home like 5 minutes ago. So I'm hoping I wanted to start this right at 7. It's just... I don't understand how it could take 5 to 6 hours just to try to do something. Like, I wanted to get through it house at like 3 so we can eat. Come back home, it'll be like 5. Max. 5.30 maybe. And then that would be it. And then I can set the game up and do all this sort of stuff. Why is it having such a hard time launching if everything's loaded? I don't know. Hello, golf kid. Thank you for tuning in. <sighs> um, is this game gonna load, please? I, I just, <laughs> I'm, I'm so frustrated. Either way, I'm. I'm very curious to see what this game is. I've, I've heard a lot of good things about it. Uh, it just it was hard for me to kind of figure out um, where to start because there's so many different 
like games and different like spin-offs so I had to make sure you know I was getting the right one Tell me to launch over here. All right, we'll do that. <clears throat> I'm, I'm, ah, oh, it's so loud. Where's my, my mouse? Help. I want to get invested, but I can't even hear myself speak. I can't even adjust my audio. Mono. Oh my god, my ears. I'm so sorry, chat. I can't. I can't even. I can't be. Okay. Where, where's my mouth? I, I... Help. <laughs> Help. Oh my god, my ears. I... Ah. I can't even check. Oh. Just want to look at my volume settings. Oh my god! And as soon as I do it, then the thing. Okay, god damn it, god damn it. I just want to see what the fuck. Okay, okay. I, please, I need to adjust the volume. It, I mean, my ears. Holy shit! Voice volume is fine. Uh, I hope that saved it. Holy shit, my ears. Oh my god. I hope that fixed it. Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god. I'll pro I'll, I'll definitely lower this on the thing. What the f I can't move my mouse. Okay, I gotta hit the Windows button just to look at my volume. Alright, that's that should be better. I at least I at least I hope so. Okay. All right. Well, obviously this is a new game because I I've not touched this before. That intro might have been amazing if my ears didn't die, and I was trying to. <laughs> I wish I had time to look at shit. Okay. Oh my god, my hair. For a second there, it was the music was bumping. Okay. New game. English, please. Is there Japanese subtitles? I'm gonna go with English regardless. Logic difficulty. I'm just gonna leave everything in the middle, because I don't know what the hell I'm doing. We're just gonna go very medium. Because I... I don't know what the hell I'm doing. <laughs>
Holy shit, camera rolling. Thank you. Damn, that's, I appreciate that. So what? What the hell's going on? Blast off. Okay. Okay, uh... What? That does that's not as very that does not feel like a happy panda. Nothing about that gives me happy panda vibes. Ooh. I like that logo. Tripper, trigger happy havoc. The massive high school towers all over the other buildings. In this bustling urban area. It's like the school stands at the center of the entire world. Okay. Hope's Peak Academy. It brings in top students from every field imaginable, a government-funded school of privilege. We, we, we dealing with privileged children. They say if you come here and manage to graduate, you'll be set for life. With hundreds of years of tradition, it sends the cream of the crop into the workforce every year. Damn! It was built to raise hope in the nation's future, which makes Hope's Peak a pretty fitting name. Thank you, Cam and Roland, for $10. I really appreciate that. I, I didn't get a chance to elaborate on it, but thank you. There are two things you need to attend the school. One, you have to have, have to already be attending high school. Two, you have to be the very best at what you do. Ooh, this is like elite. This is like elite people. No ordinary student can enroll here. The only way is if you're scouted by the school itself. Ooh, damn. And standing there at the gate of the ultimate school filled with the ultimate students, I'm assuming the teacher, was me. Oh, that's our main character. Before we go any farther, I guess I should introduce myself. My name's Makoto Naegi. Hello. But a hopelessly average high school student. Okay. Average on the outside, average on the inside. I really don't have much going for me when it comes to grades, special abilities, even personality. I mean, yeah, I've had, I've always had, like I, but it's not like I'm psychotic or mutant or whatever. Okay. Like, if you ask me what my favorite show or favorite TV show is, they all be just whatever is most popular at this particular moment. Well, that sounds like a very, 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 very middle person. <laughs> Even among average, I'm completely average. So I can't say I'm your everyday hero type. That's just who I am. Okay. Anyway, I figure it's always good to introduce yourself right off the bat. But you know, if I have any kind of strong point, so to speak, I'd say I'm a little more gun ho. Okay. Look at me, I'm completely ordinary, but still... Here I am standing in front of anything but word. Okay. Uh, I still believe I'm standing here. I still can't believe I'm standing here. I wonder if someone like me can survive in a place like this. I got this overwhelming presence like it's trying to swallow me whole. Ooh. But it's no wonder I would feel that way. What you have to understand is... Let me just tell you about the preparation I did last night to get ready for today. Advice to those students who are truly elite. Yeah, it's such a popular topic. There are threads online dedicated to talking about the school attends. So to prepare, I looked up some of those threads. So let's talk about ultimate students who are way beyond your average high school. Okay. I like that. For example, when it comes to students, the ultimate pop sensation. 
I guess she's a high school girl. He was also the lead singer for a pop group of famous along the country. Ooh. Also, ultimate baseball star. Clean up hitter for national high school. Pro teams already have their eyes on him. All right. Ultimate fashion, fashion steer. Okay. She's been a cover of tons of fashion magazines. She's what every high school girl wants to be. Oh my God, it's Kuwabara. <laughs> oh, and they mentioned the ultimate biker gang leader too. The scary thing is he is the de facto leader of the biker gang in Japan. Gangs everywhere love the guy. On top of that, there is the ultimate martial artist, the ultimate fanfic center, the ultimate gambler, the ultimate swimming pool, ultimate programmer, ultimate clairvoyant, and then some. Reading that made me realize how totally powers I was. It was the country's finest top to bottom. It felt like a tame little house cat who wandered into a pride of lions. <laughs> So there was something I couldn't stop thinking about. I see there was a few students who couldn't find any info on, no matter how much I looked. With all those ultimate students, I'm the only one without any kind of worthwhile talent. But then, what about those new students who didn't seem to pop up anywhere? Could they just be average students like me without any talent or anything? And I thought... I thought it was kind of encouraging. I mean, I know I don't have much in the way personality, but beyond that, there's even a bigger issue. How did such an unbelievably average student like me get picked to come to this ultimate? That's a good question. There is a reason. You just have to take one glance at the acceptance letter they sent me to see why. Recently held a lottery to select one ordinary student. Oh, okay, so they must have been randomly picked then. <laughs> As a result, you've been selected and like, damn, that's that's lucky. They spelled it out plain as day. I got invited by pure luck. Okay. Honestly, I probably would have been better off just declining their offer. But after hearing how graduating was a guarantee for a success later in life, I couldn't say no. But then, staying there in front of the school, I started to feel lost like I didn't belong there. I could feel myself losing my nerve. But still, I can't just stand here in front of the gate forever. Frozen in place, murmuring to myself, I looked down at the acceptance letter clutched in my hand. It said there'd be a meeting for all incoming students in the May Hall at 8 a.m. The meeting still isn't for a while, but I probably should just head in. Yeah, I have to do this. All right. I gathered up all my determination and tried to act like I'd done this a million times before. And I took my first step towards the main hall. Okay. This is where we're supposed to be, right? I guess I'm the first one here. There's a really elegant clock over in the corner. It says 7.10. The meeting doesn't start till 8, so there's still 50 minutes left. It makes sense nobody would be here yet. I was so bound up, I got here way too early. I feel like I do that a lot in life, where I get to places too early if I'm scheduled for something. Like, I, I always try to get there. I have plenty of time before the meeting. Just standing around waiting isn't exactly... I should take a look around the school. Maybe that'll help calm me down a little. I am a student here now, so there shouldn't be any problem with me having a look around. I'll help kill some time, if nothing else. I'm trying to play it cool, I took my first step into Hope Peaks Academy. It's also my first step towards starting a new life at the high school. At least that's what I was hoping for. Okay. What? What? What the hell? What's what the f <laughs> Is he in Genjutsu? It was like some kind of illusion melting away and mixing together into something else. Spinning, mixing, melting. Oh my god. And the next moment, everything went black. That's how it all began. Oh, so he's kind of like telling us after the fact. Like, is he, he's like recounting all of the shit that happened. Okay. that That's that's the way it feels like it's being phrased here. And how life as I knew it came to an end. At that point, I should have realized. The reason I was brought to Holmes Academy wasn't because I had ultimate... Uh-oh. If so, I could experience ultimate despair. Oh, no. That does... That's... 
Oh, that's, 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 that's concerning. Yes. Yeah, we'll save there. What the fuck? Oh, what's going on? A lot of dots. Mg. I woke up with my head resting on top of a hardwood desk. My body feels heavy. It's pretty normal for me to zonk off in the middle of the same boring class or whatever, but... What was I doing asleep here just now? This isn't a classroom I've ever been in before. What the heck is going on? Explain the basic controls. You can use the left stick to adjust your aim. If you aim at an object, you can interact. Press the A button. If you press though, you'll investigate that object. Use the directional buttons or the L and R buttons to adjust your viewpoint. I'm using the regular uh, 360 controller, which I think this is what this game was made of back back then in like 2010. So this should be like pretty accurate to everything they're saying on screen here. Use the direction buttons or use the L and R to adjust your viewpoint. Okay. Why don't you try looking around the classroom? Okay. So there's a letter. Okay. That's the desk I fell asleep on. I still... I can still see a line of, line of drool. Ew. Ew. I'll have to clean that up later. Okay, what, uh, some kind of cheap-looking pamphlet, and here's something handwritten on it. The next semester is about to start. Starting today, the school will be in your... In oh, God, that's... that's threatening. We've got a camera. A surveillance camera. It's a dangerous world we live in. I guess they have to keep weirdos from wandering in. Okay. That is really weird looking. <laughs> that, what, what, there's screws as like, that's, that, that's like, that feels like, that's, that's, that's a wild mental, metal, metal, visual image. Some kind of metal plate has been bolted over it, and if I were wrong. Okay. Yep. Okay. That's not what matters here. Most importantly, why are the metal plates over the windows? That is a very good question. Can't believe it's already eight o'clock. It was just seven when we first got here. Damn. Okay. He's up for a bit. Let's do it. So what might have happened is I got myself so wound out I pass I passed out in the main hall and then someone carried him here. Okay. That's true. That raises more questions. This is all really. Sweet. I should probably head back to the main hall. It's already past the meeting here. It might be other students' time here. You can leave the classroom by pressing the B button. Is there anything else for me to look at? TV. Something feels off a little bit. Okay. Okay. It wouldn't let me click on that. So we got doors. Leave the area. Okay. Yeah, all, yeah, definitely weird. I have no idea what's going on. Well, for now, let's just head to the main hall. There's a left stick to move through the hallway. Hold down B button while moving to run. Also, you can press Y button to bring up a map. Press Y button again to close the map. How convenient. All right, that's simple enough. Oh, now, now the door is locked from the outside. What about this door? Is that close? Okay, okay. Figure figures that's close too. Imagine going to a school and they just not want to teach you things, and they lock the door. That feels like my life.
the spare hotel. I guess it's a place people to stay overnight. Okay. Well, I'm just exploring, you know? Okay. Trying to understand the madness. AB. Wow, they really don't. They really. What the hell? Okay. Uh. Okay. Let's see. Let's, let's walk around. Around here. Let's, what's this? Is that? Did I just get? By the time I got back to the main hall, everyone was already there. That's weird. Okay. Ooh. Whoa, hey! Another new kid? Huh? Then you guys are all... Yeah. We're all new here. Today's supposed to be our first day of class. So, counting him, that makes 15. Seems like a good cutoff point, but I wonder if this is everyone. Ultimate students that have been handpicked by the school. Looked around everyone who gathered here, taking in their faces one at a time. Maybe I was just imagining if I swear I feel a kind of aura coming out of them. Oh my god. Do they have stands? They better have stands. Uh hello. Sorry I'm late, a bunch of stuff happened, and then all of a sudden I was just asleep. Huh? <laughs> hmm. Things keep getting curiouser and curious. Mm hmm. Shut up without this is strange. Thing. Okay, so maybe it wasn't just him that fell asleep. Uh, honestly, I have no idea what's going on right Got now. Got it. Listen to me. Your tardiness is unacceptable. Oh, we got the uh, we got the uptight person. We got the uptight person. That feels like that feels like something. <laughs> Be late on your first days on speak I must report you. Go! Re report him! Go for it! See, see what happens. Why, why what? can't... What's your problem? It's not like he wanted to be late. He didn't have any control. That's right! Everyone just come down listen to why don't we all... Huh? <laughs> I like her. Something about her. I like her. It may be good at least to find out who we are before digging in the bigger problems here. I mean, how are we supposed to even talk to each other? We don't know each other's names. I want to know your name! Yeah. I want to know your name, too! Um... I like I like these girls. Uh, we move on. Okay. Uh, I think it's just best to keep on focusing. Uh, let's see. I already looked up on that Hope Speaker panel thread online, but... I still don't really know what kind of people they actually are. I'm trying to find out. I'll start talking to those five over there. Aim at a student, press A to talk to them. Okay, each conversation is important to the overall story, so keep track of how we go. Don't chat, don't you dare spoil me what's gonna happen. I swear, I will not look at chat ever again if you spoil it. I want I want to be blind. Each conversation is important to the overall story. Okay. Where, where is she? Where's, where's, I like her. Oh, we'll just, we'll start right to left. I am Hifumi Yamada. But if you want to call me by my nickname, the Alpha and the Omega. I don't mind. Oh my God, we got a nerd. We got a nerd. Mm -hmm. By the way, how much do you know about the world of 2D art? A lot! I like it. World of 2D. <laughs> I am known as the ultimate. Oh my god! Oh my god, is this me in 10 years? Well, in that world, I am known as Supreme. Oh no, he is an ultimate weeb! Mm -hmm. Maybe. I once sold 10,000 copies as one of my fan comics at a school festival. The event has passed into legend. Damn. Hmm. Well, good, good for him. Some of that didn't. Some of them did get it. Of course, I'm saying, saying I tainted the event. <laughs> oh, that's funny. That's too bad about them. But selling 10,000 copies like that it definitely is pretty unlikely. However, the words of such idiots mean nothing. 
I'm like Van Gogh. Oh my god, he's got the ego of the people on Twitter. Utterly unappreciated in my time. I am a soldier, serving night and day to destroy all mindless preconceptions about fan fiction. Oh my god, this feels like me! I'm sure if you were to observe my work, Mr. Nagy, you can comprehend its greatness. Mm -hmm. For my work was filled with deepest meanings. Oh, I'm curious. What what does this mean? Yes, indeed. This really feels like me. What? <laughs> Bracing our basest urges. Oh, I. What does that mean? What? Why would you not want to comprehend it? I want to know. What? Tell me the 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 mm. thing. I want to know what it means. All right, well, what, what, what's his Yo, name? Yo, the name's Leon Kuwata. What's up? I like that. <laughs> this is you 11 years. Stop! I was not like that 11. I mean, 11 years in the future. I recognize that name. Oh, uh-oh. Oh, okay. As, as their cleanup hitter, the ultimate baseball star. And that superb athletic specimen is. Huh. Huh? Yeah, he does definitely look a little bit different from that picture. I figured with you being the ultimate baseball Give me a star. Break. Ha! Ha, yes! Well, I guess shorter hair. No, I was just expecting more of a, you know, sporty looking traditional baseball player type. I found that article with a picture of you online, that's how you look that. <laughs> What the crap? Uh-oh. Oh, he didn't he didn't have a choice. Shaving your head like that is part of the national championship for me. Mean, seriously? How but now I refuse to cut my hair, I'm not gonna die back to normal. Hey listen! Actually I can be totally honest. You know. Oh ha what? So he's just a mega Chad? <laughs> Baseball? Uh, like, I've never gone to a single practice. That's... Yeah! That's wild. That's wild. That's, that, that's some talent. <laughs> uh, oh, music. I feel the all-star quality. You know what I mean. I'm gonna be a singer, so I need a songwriter. And some How songwriter. cool is that? That's... Huh. Never imagined to hear something like that. Well, can I leave? <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Sayaka. Okay. Hi, I'm Sayaka Mizono. I look forward to getting to know you. Oh. Okay. Way she moves is positively mesmerizing, and that pleasant scent I can't place. Saw her name in the thread. I frankly was pretty surprised. Oh, it's that one. Oh, okay. Pop group. Uh, in fact, she's their lead singer. Ultimate pop sensation. See, she high demand to appear on TV and magazines everywhere. But actually, she's not the only reason. I was so surprised to find out she's coming to school. I'm sure she doesn't remember, but never mind. What? 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 The mysteries. I'm feeling Mister Mysteriousness. Well, never mind. No matter how you slice it, she's really beautiful. Almost like a doll or something. <laughs> I feel like something's gonna happen. Where she is evil. I got this strange feeling. I'm alive. Huh, is she hear me? I... I'm psyched. Huh. <laughs> huh. Hey, um... Uh, by any chance... Huh? Yeah, it must be, I'm sure. Just hold on! Really? Why does he remind me of that one guy from Fooly Cooly that has, like, the really big eyebrows? It reminds me of that. <laughs> How did you plan to waste your valuable time with this ridiculous back and forth? Uh, um... You hear me? Self-introductions are for introducing yourself, not bumbling through a bunch of idols. Um... Sorry. I wonder if that still would have happened if I picked somebody else other than that. Like, I wonder if the 
order of the conversations would be different. Like, he would have interrupted somebody else if I picked someone else. I don't know. Huh. It's not like we'll ever see each other. Okay. Fine. We'll get him. We'll get him out of the way because he wants to talk about I'm us. Kiyotaka Ishimaru. I believe in bold simplicity. Let's work together on our educational crusade. Well, he so badly wanted to talk to me. What does he have to say? Uh, so according to what I heard about him on the thread, he went to a famous private school, won top honors every year. What? He's basically a flawless honor student. He's also known for the work he's done with the community's public morals committee. He says he respects about the rules, above all else, earning him the title of ultimate moral compass. Hmm. Hmm. Huh. Okay. <laughs> you should thank your parents for your You hear me? To keep the name from losing you must devote yourself every single day. Got it! Life is worth putting every ounce of effort into it right. Okay. <laughs> he says he's annoying. That's funny. That's it. He so desperately wanted to talk about something. Just to... I'm a little annoyed. Not that you'll remember my name anyway, but... I'm Toko. Toko Fukawa. Okay. Okay, she, okay, she was good at writing. She wrote a novel when she was 10 that got everyone talking and launched her literary career. Then two years ago, she released So Lingers, the Ocean Old Story. So to be her masterpiece, the book was such a hit with women that fishermen quickly shot to the top of every... Wait. The book was such a hit with women that fishermen quickly shot to the top of every hottest man. Alright, she's won countless literary prizes and all books. She's instant bestseller. Which is why she's come to know as the ultimate writing prodigy. What else could you call such a young and talented author? I figured she'd be loving to be able to mess with <laughs> That's kind of like that with a lot of people. Like, their work doesn't reflect the person at all. Like, you wouldn't believe someone's, like, how they are. I, I can... What's your problem? Uh... Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. I think she's gonna be the crazy one. I got this really bad feeling. Build the creature in the... <laughs> okay. Uh-oh. Thought you never seen... T what? <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm telling you! <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Can't stop... I we're... What am I supposed to do when I'm talking to someone? I'm supposed to go like this? Like, what? Huh? Anyway. I don't really care. I'm used to it. <laughs> Inferiority complex. I was way off. I worked six walls. Oh, we got more people! Yay, more people. Where are the other ones go? Alright, we'll start with Cool Bar and looking at Name's Mondo Awada. Nice to fucking meet you. You, can't, you can't swear on YouTube like that. People don't like that anymore. People, that that's like I'm gonna get canceled now. Yeah, we know he's like a he's a really big big old biker game. Yeah. Yep. Current leader of the largest. Oh, I guess he's just like really good. He's earned respect, even off from every gang in the country. He's the ultimate biker. Okay. Nice to meet Yo. you. Too. Oh yeah. Very careful around him. One wrong, I can end up at the bottom of the sea. <laughs> that was it. This is like the one character I always hear, I, not that I hear about, but I see the most associated with this game. So I don't know what that means. But I do. I am very f familiar with this design. I don't know much about her other than that, but I know. She, so I wonder. So this is where it all begins with her. I'm Junko Enoshima. Charmed, I'm sure. I'm scared. That smile scares me. That don't stop. That freaks me out. Like, yeah, she's beautiful in this world. I've seen tons of magazine covers, but it really doesn't quite my shaft. Wow, that's a burn. Damn. What? Come on. Are you talking about my cover photos? 
Stop! I don't... That... Those are totally photoshopped. So her fashion is a lie? What? I added to Helen back. What? What? What can we do? Come on, don't surprise you're gonna make me first. Totally! Oh god. If you're surprised by that, you'd be totally blown away by dangerous old diva <laughs> that, that that smile makes me s sussy. You can make the eyes and, uh, and tweak the skin so it looks all ceramic and ceramic and porcelain. So many dreams are getting crushed today. <laughs> Okay, can I ask your name? My name is Kyoko Kirigiri. I like her design. Ultimate question mark. She's pretty tight lipped, huh? Oh, but you know, her name didn't show up anywhere in the Host Peak Academy thread. I didn't see there were students like me. Ones who didn't have any real identity or presence. Ooh, she's the mystery girl. Could this be one of them? So what are you doing at this what? school? What's that supposed to mean? Well, I meant getting invited here it means you're kind of ultimate something. So what ultimate something are you? That doesn't matter. Uh-oh. She got a tragic past or something that makes me... Makes me feel things for her. She's being very... Very cold and standoffish. Huh. Well, I guess you don't have to tell me. <sighs> no, I don't have to tell you, so I'm going to. Damn! Nothing about her turned up online, so I was thinking maybe she got picked by chance like me, but. Her face is like an iron mask. Just don't want to tell me anything, no point in asking. She's got some kind of past. We have to, have to break the ice with her. Hello, nice to meet you. I'm Chihiro Fujisaki. Okay. Ooh, ultimate programmer. I like that. Mm. Uh, okay, well, I introduce myself like this. <laughs> Anyways, I hope we can get along. Same here, nice to meet you. Huh? Oh no. Oh no, don't tell me. Maybe it's just my imagination that we've met before. I don't think so. We have just met for the first time, which is why I said this. I'm sorry. You'll have to apologize. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. She's known for the cutting edge program she's created. She's the ultimate programmer. She's also got the. She's got that timid little bunny type thing going, which has endeared her to. Endeared her to her legion of fans. Um. So, uh, I'm sorry. What? Huh? Um. What? I feel like that's. I feel like there's a part of me in there that, that acts like that. Huh? Thank you. I, you know what? I can relate. I can relate on a on a basic level. So I always really, I always worry about if I'm like upsetting someone. <laughs> we got a connection. I, 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 I can relate to that. I'm starting to understand why her fans are so into her. Yeah. Yeah, she, she be cute. We got this one. Okay. Hey ya! I'm Aoi Asahina. But my friends just call me Hina. Sup? Swimming pro. Hello, Mark Harmon. Thank you for tuning in. I appreciate it. She's been breaking records in every competition she's been in since uh, she's been chosen as an upcoming Olympic cadet. She is without doubt the ultimate swimming pro. The combination of her ability, appearance, and... Oh no. We're going there, huh? I mean, it do be good. It do be good. It has. Wait, the combination. So are. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. So pe when people talk about her, like, breasts and stuff online, is that the implication here? That's funny. Alright. Uh, sorry, totally forgot. <laughs> oh yeah, I knew it was something like that. 
No, not something like that. It is that. You got it. <laughs> sure, got it. Here, I'll hammer it into my brain. Right yeah. <laughs> Just kept repeating my name, and moving your finger across your palm like he was writing something. What are you doing? Huh? You don't know if I want to remember someone's name. I got to write on my hand three times. I never heard of anyone doing that. Mm. By the way, how do you spell your last name? Mm. <laughs> what? Well, I have no idea. Just figure it out later and write it down. Okay. One thing I learned is she's totally easy going and bursting with energy. Those four over there are the only ones left. Oh, it's that one! I, that, I, I like your design. I do not think we have been introduced. I am Celestia Ludenberg. We're having a fancy edge. Very, very monocle-esque, monocle-eye-esque name. I, I could feel, I could feel the elegant, eloquentness, eloquentness. I can't even speak. Ooh, a gambling pro, apparently. <laughs> Celestia. Are you Japanese? Huh? What do you ask? Tell me your real name. <laughs> As I mentioned that, I'd much rather you call me. But pretty forceful at the same time, I don't think she wants to say more about it. I guess the rumor's about the threat about her. Self-styled, she's the ultimate gambler who never lost a bet. Other than her obvious love of gothic Lolita clothes, everything about her is wrapped in a veil of lies. Ooh. Ooh. She might be lying about her name then. They say she entered in one an underground gambling tournament, earning the title Queen of Liars. Ooh. She totally cleaned out the other players, taking their life savings and laughing as she did it. Oh. <laughs> Little sinister side. I like that. Just don't, don't fuck with me, though. <laughs> smiles beyond deceptive, I better watch myself around her. I would agree. I'm Yasuhiro Hagakure. Hero for short. Take it easy, yeah? I know I will. Hello. Supernova in the psychic community trend setting ultimate clairvoyant. I think that's how you say it. I'm so stupid. Don't don't you dare spoil it for me, Mark Harmon! I swear to God, I don't I, I don't want to be I don't want to be spoiled. I don't really get all that fortune telling stuff, but it's pretty much the stuff. It's pretty much beyond. Me. Still, I can't help wondering if there's any truth to it. Could it be for serious? I saw. I looked right at it seriously. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Guardian Angel, crazy per chasing after what the fuck? What? The Guardian Angel is. Your guardian. <laughs> is this gonna be one of those things where like he's gonna be right about something, even if it sounds insane? I don't, I don't crazy. I don't, I don't know. Grad some brewskis, brewskis. Oh my god, I haven't heard that name in a while. I haven't heard that type of phrase in a while. I get real deep into Lamora and its civilization. Ooh. Not allowed to drink. Oh, okay. You know, twenty-one. And hold back a few times and see well it's a long story uh oh we got some backstory potential in the future with him then a few times yeah i bet that is a crazy story name's byakuya togami hello Thank you, Mark, for clarifying. <laughs> nice to meet you. That's the most half-ass introduction I've ever heard. What? I mean, I don't know. It's okay to me. But there really isn't anything I can do about it. Even among the ultimate students, this one's special. It's the hair parent his family's massive financial conglomerate. He's already started managing business operations in his own personal sets. Are well vast. He's the ultimate affluent pro 
I can't. I can I speak English? I don't think so. It's completely accurate. He's the definition of exceptional. That's everything I learned about him from the hopes. Come on. We're done with introductions, right? How much longer are you gonna stand here? Go away, I'm sick of looking at I'm sick of looking at you too. Zara says to me, you and I will never stand on the same level like a king in training. I hate people like that. I hate people like that. What is going on with this? I need uh, I need information. I am Sakura Ogami. Hello. Oh! Ultimate martial artist. Oh, sweet. I almost, <laughs> I almost asked her if she was a guy. Oh my god. Oh my god. Day, day I say something like that out loud. The day I get turned into a human being. Oh yeah. Now I remember. She competed in. Like, wait, wait, it's a girl. I need answers. But now I remember she competed in martial arts tournament in America and won despite being a girl. Ultimate martial arts she fought in over 400 matches, never lost a single one. Thread also said more about her. Some call her an ogre. So that's fucked up. Jeez. <laughs> oh my god. Some even think she's the closest known relative to the primates the famed missing one. Wow. Purina is letting know. If you value your life, avoid her at all costs. Oh god. I don't think they were exaggerating about that. Hey. Yes. I snapped uh, to attention without even realizing it. I just started to poke and prod at my body. Um, what are you? I see. Muscular quantity and quantity is right around extremely high. Okay. Hmm. You're not at all. <laughs> oh my god. What a shame. You're not at all fit to act as my training partner. I'm not sure that's such a shame for me. And with all that, the introductions are done. Even though they're all ultimate, they each have their own individual sort of um, something. Hmm. Okay, time to get down to business. This is no time to stand around making friends with a bunch of dull eyed but... Wow. Oh my god. That's gotta piss off you that, that, that girl. The soccer girl. He's not gonna happy about calling her. Okay. I think someone said something about bigger problem or something. It was about that. Um, listen. Uh, um. So a bunch of stuff happened here and you were just asleep, right? Well, that is true for all of us. Ooh. Okay. I mean, seriously? Just after each of us got to the main hall, we lost consciousness. When we came to, we were somewhat here in the school. And then, okay. That's just weird. Every one of us would get knocked out like that. Piece of shit! <laughs> That's why we're all freaking out. Mm. That's the only thing you saw were all the windows in the classes and hallways. Yeah, they were locked. That was weird. But yeah, yeah, what yeah, what is all that about? Are you for real? Oh my god, they stole people's stuff. Um I haven't seen the PDA anywhere either. <clears throat> huh. Front exit is completely blocked by some giant metal hat. What does this mean? But there wasn't anything like that when you first got what the heck? I agree. Aww. Crime? Is what? it like kidnapping? <laughs> Maybe they grab us and hold us off. And we're not actually at school. Hey, come on! But this is all part of the school's orientation procedure. You know? I'm sure that's sitting there taking us. You did to snap? I see. Huh. What the hell? You know what I mean. Wow, dude. You're just gonna take a nap in a place you're not quite sure what's quite going on. I was up way too last late. I feel everyone's tension evaporating. But then it began. Bing bong? You can't say that on, on the internet anymore. Okay, what's what going on? Ahem, ahem, testing, testing, mic check, one, two, this is a test of the school broadcast system. Dad voice. Am I on? Can everyone hear me? Okay, well then. Totally out of place. It was so playful, so completely unconcerned. I couldn't help but feel deep, unnerving dread at the sound of it. It was like hearing someone laugh at the scene in an accident. Uh, to all in 
incoming students. I would like to begin the entrance ceremony at... Right now! <laughs> Please make your way to the gymnasium at your earliest convenience. That's all. I'll be waiting. I, I agree. Goodbye. What? what? <laughs> it just peaced out? All right. Can't take off just like Could that. Could it be? It's all pumped up. <laughs> that, that, if that, that can't be a joke. No, Th no, that's not right. That's not, that, I can't be it. Be freaked out if it was real. You know? I, I wonder what they got planned for us. Huh. Uh... Huh? Everybody leaving. <laughs> they're they're too chill about this. I I would be very <laughs> Wow, they just all pieced out. Anyway. Not that anybody cares about it. Everybody took off to the gym, but I was frozen where I stood. That uneasy feeling I had before I couldn't get it out of my mind. And it looked like I wasn't the only one. Uh, um yeah, something clearly isn't right. This is bad. Yeah, the announcement was told. Yeah. However, I like how the girls are, are aware of it. I, I like that. Maybe, but just staying put doesn't mean we'll be safe. Besides, aren't you guys just a bit curious to find out what's going on around here? I see. Do not move. We do not move forward. We learn nothing. No achievements to pull us forward. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I. I would be nervous too. We don't have a choice. We have to go. It said go to the gym, right? Yeah. Uh, do we just do I just peace out too, or? Well. Pretty sure everyone's okay. I guess we, I guess we just peace out. Huh. Okay, um, I guess I'll, uh, I guess I'll just, I'll just peace out too. I, yeah, I, I mean, that, um, I don't know where that, that thing is, but we'll figure it out eventually, I guess. Didn't they say they were going, or, yeah, they said they were going to go somewhere. Yeah, can we just leave? That would... <laughs> can we just leave? Ooh. Ooh. Hey, come on. Oh, they were following me. Okay. Uh, this is hopefully a place with some music. Wow. Oh. Not really much different from the time I spent in Juvie. How this place is even uh, worse. Um... Yeah. This is bad. For the worst, no, nothing venture, nothing game. Uh, shit. <laughs> yeah. Hey, damn it. Where's whoever calls? What are you thinking? Well then. <laughs> oh my god. <coughs> that that feels no. I would not act like that in that situation. I would just not leave. Like I would not scream. Type for some more tutorial action. You can press the Y button to observe the room you're in. Observing will display what people and objects you can interact with. Sorry for the delayed notice. Ooh. Ooh. Can look at the sword, I guess. Display case are all kinds of trophies and plaques inside, of course. All the students who go here are ultimate, right? This is probably just a tiny fraction of all the rewards. That would make sense to me. Uh, okay, so it's all the... This is bad. Yeah.
still filled with uneasy dread, I did what the announcement said went to the gym. And I saw it was waiting for us there. Yo! Totally normal entrance. And... <laughs> Not normal. Hey there! Howdy! Hello! Is everyone here? Good! Then let's get things rolling! <laughs> Ooh, cutscene. She's gonna get real. Huh? A teddy bear? I'm not a teddy bear. I am Monokuma! <laughs> and I am this school's headmaster! Huh. The strangest thing he's ever seen. Yeah. Was utterly what I was seeing was utterly incomprehensible. Nice to meet you all. Your bright voice and carefree attitude was completely out of place. And all that anxiety I've been carrying with me suddenly transformed to downright fear. Say what? Down the There's just a speaker inside hey, it. Hey, come on now. Ha! <laughs> Monokuma, I'm your headmaster. Say what? Maybe this is what I'm gonna be like in ten years. Like maybe this is who I'm gonna be like. <laughs> come down. It's probably just a remote control toys. Oh my god. Dare you compare me to a child's plaything? You've cut your teeth deeper than out of trench. <laughs> My remote control system is so complex, even the folks at NASA can't recreate or even comprehend it. Ooh, don't make me say something about destroy NASA's dreams. Oh my god, the pun! I couldn't bear it. Stop. Well, that really, you are unfortunate. Hmm. Let me get started. Come on. I agree. Now then. Okay, quiet down. Okay. Huh. Has abandoned the gag. Good morning. Yeah. You hear me? What's your problem? <laughs> okay. Now then. A most noteworthy and memorable entrance ceremony. Let's talk a bit about your school life here and what it would be like. Now make no mistake, you few students so full of potential represent the hope of the world. And to protect such splendid hope, you will all live a communal life together solely within the confines of this school. Everyone will live in harmony together and adhere to the rules and regulations of this school. Huh. Hmm. I, I literally said what he said. Regarding the end date for this communal Too life. Bad. There what? You all be here until the day. What? The day you die? <laughs> oh my god. Such is the school life you've been assigned. Oh my god. Yeah, I. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but fear not, we have quite an ab abundant budget, so you won't lack for all the common conveniences. Uh, hold on a second. <laughs> hmm. Get to live here forever. It's true. I am no liar. I can... oh uh huh. Just for information, you're completely cut off from the outside world. Oh my God! There's no Twitter, so you don't have to worry about th that dirty, dirty land behind. The world. <laughs> cut off. Okay, that would explain it then. Phew. That's exactly what they're there for. How much you may yell and scream for help, they will not come. So with all that in mind, feel free to live out your life with reckless abandon. Hey, come on! I don't care if school or whatever else is behind it all. This is a really bad show. D Damn you! Unbelievable. A bunch of skeptics. What are you gonna do? But I guess you can't help it, huh? If you all grow up in an age where you're taught to doubt your neighbor. That, that is still true to this day, honestly. I mean, at least for that feels true to me. We have plenty of time to find out whether or not I say it's true. 
when that time comes, you'll see your own eyes. Well, what? What? Oh, you'll see with your own eyes. You'll see with your own eyes. Like, oh my god. Again. I speak the undeniable truth. Most unfortunate. That'd be quite the problem. What's this? Come on now, what's matter? You decided your own free will to attend Hope's. And before the entrance ceremony, you see the finish, you already decided you want to leave. Hey! Um. Um. Well, I don't. I, well, if they didn't tell you that, then yeah, I would be pretty upset to hear that. <laughs> you, th that's what I was thinking. You did forget to mention. Oh, never mind. Something, <laughs> something else. Okay. You did forget to mention the one thing. There is one way for you to leave the school. <laughs> Not you. As headmaster, I've crafted a special clause for those who would like to leave. call it the graduation. Clause. Now then. I bet it's gonna be like extremely difficult to like get that clause or something like that. In order to maintain an environment of harmony here, we, we rely on communal lifestyle. And if someone were to disrupt that harmony, they and they alone would be allowed to leave the school. That, my students, is a graduation clause. What? Disrupt the harmony. <laughs> Oh my god. If one person were to murder another. Oh shit. Oh my god. Yes indeed. Stabbing, strangling, bludgering, crushing, hacking, drowning, igniting. How you do it doesn't matter. You must kill someone if you want to leave. It's as simple as that. <laughs> the rest's up to you. Give it you're all to achieve the best outcome in the worst way possible. Well, that... Oh, oh my god. A chill shot went down my spine. You must kill someone if you want to leave. As soon as I heard those words, my blood went cold. <laughs> Got your brain juices flowing. Beats the heck out of... Beats the heck out of a human catching a salmon. I guess for you guys are the hope of the world, but you know... Taking that hope and seeing it get murdered creates a darkened shadow of despair. Extreme! Oh no. Shit just got what real. Hell? Shit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> kill each other, it's. Yeah. Huh? Kill each other is. To kill each other is to kill each other. I'm sure there's a dictionary somewhere. If you... <laughs> what are you saying? <laughs> That's not the problem. Why do we have to do this? Hey, what? I, you know, I agree. Uh, just let's go. Blabbering. <laughs> blabbering, blabbering. What do you mean blabbering? Stop blabbering on about blabbering on. <laughs> oh my god. Let's go. Let's go. Keep on saying the same thing over and over again. Listen from this woman on. This school is your home, your life, your world. Got it. Kill as much as you want to kill. So go ahead. Go on a kill, kill. Oh my god. Uh, hmm? You know? You got us, okay? You scared the hell out of us, so we can go on ahead and go. Huh? I'm right, right? Yeah, I mean, this is all some sort of trick. Dude, shit. Shoving her aside, Mondo placed himself in front of his voice, rumbling like this. You're fucking dead. Can't say that on YouTube anymore. Okay, I'm, I'm kidding. Listen up. Okay, she's just going too far with the control piece. What's the matter? Wow, he just had to burn. That's a deep burn. You son of a bitch. <laughs> On the road out. There's a sudden boom. There's a sound of floorboards as he kicked off. And launched himself into the air. He flew like <laughs> straight as a bullet. He locked on his target. Gotcha, you little piece of shit! <laughs> I don't know if you're a toy or a stuffed animal or whatever the hell. Either way, I'm gonna rip you to fucking shreds! <laughs> what? Violence against the headmaster is in violation of school regulations! Shut the fuck up! <laughs> Let me out of here, I swear to Christ! Hey, damn it! Piece of 
shit! Watch out! Huh? What? Is that a, is that a bomb? <laughs> yeah, what? 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 <laughs> is it? Was it really a remote control? What the? I blew the hell up. There's painful rain ears and all that. It smells gunpowder. Explosions might happen all the time in movies or whatever, but it's not a life. Or something like it. But. Means that teddy bear has been destroyed. Hey! Damn you! Of course! He did violate one of the schools. Oh shit. I'll let you up with the warning this time, but you better be careful from now on. Any naughty boy or girl who violates my rules won't get off the full swat on the foot. This is bad. So this is me like a bunch of more go around somewhere? Yep. That's, that feels like a robot. Or like someone's like remote controlling them then or something to place them around there like that. Plus don't forget the surveillance cameras installed everywhere. If you're a cop breaking any rules, well, you all just saw what happened. <laughs> and I won't be so forgiving with my punishment next time, so what happened. Huh? <laughs> well? Come, come right here. Choice entry into our school, I will send you Your official student handbook. You can see it's fully digital, so naturally we call it the e-handbook. It's funny because a lot of this, a lot of stuff has gone digital so much in the last like 10 years, especially with like COVID, so like... Even though this is only like 11 years old, it, that's kind of true to, <laughs> to what it is like now. Like a lot of things have gotten like digital like that. To a healthy school lifestyle, use it. When you start up, it will display your name. Always make sure you have the right one. <laughs> now, this is not your everyday notebook, so it has way more many uses. What? Than that. Also, it's completely waterproof. Splash a washer dry on it, and it'll keep on ticking. But thanks to its space age design, it can withstand an impact force up to 10 tons. This is like a weapon. You can use it as a weapon. It contains all of our school regulations, so make sure you review them thoroughly. You guys! You hear me say this a lot, but any violation of school regulations will not be tolerated. Shing! Rules restrict, yes, but also they protect society. For example, if you further. Yeah, yeah. Yes, indeed! Which is why it's crucial we have strict punishments in place for violations. Okay, well, that brings our entrance ceremony. Bye bye! Please enjoy your abundantly dreary school life. This is gonna drive people insane. Oh my god, this is. Who the hell is gonna crack first? And with that, he was gone, leaving us all in a safe shock. What the crap? Oh. She's already tweaking. She's already tweaking. It just oh my oh she's gonna be she's gonna she's gonna lose it. Kill. <laughs> what just happened? Calm down. Everyone will need to calm down. First let's take a second to summarize everything which is I smart! That reminds me of Robin being level headed in a, in like a stressful situation. I I like her. Kyoko! I don't know if that's how you say his name. I like you. Just smart. Based on what she said, we essentially have two choices. Choice number one is what we is what we each stay here, living a communal life together until the day we die. The other choice is Indeed. Yeah, we have to kill someone. That's that's <laughs> Oh my god! We were abducted out of nowhere and stuff and What would the parents think then? Like, if this happened, like wouldn't the parent do they? We were ducked out of nowhere and stopped in this place meant to look like a school, and we're supposed to start. Okay, if this hap if this really is, if this happens in real life, it would depend on like 
like what it's in the school can i still like have my like computer can i still have phones like or is it just like you get you get none of that and you're only supposed to like just eat and drink and and like you can't interact like you can't go online and look at porn is like is that the if you don't i mean i would probably go mad just not having that <laughs> Are we supposed to start killing each other? St stop! Ridiculous. Shut up! A lie. What is this? All these ridiculous things we've heard this dog has. Hmm. If it's real or fake. Whatever. What matters is. So, in other words. Is there anyone here who's seriously considering all this? So that nobody had a response. Uh oh. And the music stopped too, so some shit's gonna happen. Keeping quiet myself, I looked around at the others. They all stared at one another, trying to gauge each other's thoughts. I can almost taste the hostility. Oh no. Oh no. That's when it hit me. I realized that the true terror hid within the rules. Out. You must kill someone if you want to leave. Those words had planted vicious thoughts deep within each of them. Each of them became suspicious of everyone else. We were all forced to wonder if someone going to betray me. Yeah, that would drive me, that would be very, I would be so freaking anxious of, of everyone. And that is how my new school life began. School, which had come out of nowhere to raise my hopes for so high. It's not a school of hope, it's a school of despair, ooh! Yeah, yeah, that, I, I would be, I would be very anxious too. So, uh, 15 surviving students. To be continued. This gets me very anxious. Engen Rapham. I serve that that one girl I really like, Kyoko. I if she she better be a good noodle. I don't want her to be bad. I don't, I want her to live so badly. That gives me like the Robin vibes, and I like that. Now I can actually look at this and not like have my ears bleed because that music was so incredibly loud when this game booted up that I I I really felt like dying. So, but I, I can I can take it in now. So you get punished for being talented by being trapped in something like this. Damn. That, that also means the school book. You received the school crest present. Yes. I'd like to save my data. Yeah, I would. Yeah, yeah. Uh, there was I thought about that. I could feel paralyzing fear slowly making its way through my body, dominating every last nerve. The air hung heavy on me, pressing down like a weight around my neck. I took everything I had to endure the weight. And chapter one, to survive daily life. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see what the daily life is, or like how much access they have to certain things. Because I want to know. As far, but for as heavy as the air felt. All it took to pierce it was her shoulders. And? <laughs> so what are you going to do now? Hey. Glaring at each other. Her point of comma is directed at everybody in the room. She's got that leader vibe. I, I like her. 
helped pull us all back into reality. She's got that level headed, like, I like that. She's right. Listen to me! Sometimes, even if you're nervous or afraid, you just have to step forward. <laughs> to forget such a simple fact, I can't forgive myself. You hear me? Please, someone hit me. I can't forgive myself. Somebody hit me. Push. Huh? Jesus, if you have time to yell about it, you have time to do something. About it. However. Percent, perhaps. What is the, the mission exactly? Stupid! Look for a way out. What the? Do I need to find whoever was controlling that stupid bear and get out? Yeah! I was thinking, like, that there's. It's gotta be, like, somebody controlling it or something. But, but... Before we do all that, maybe we should take a look at the handbook. It's probably best to check out the school regulations Monokuma mentioned before doing anything else. This is fine. Sure, if we stumble around with no clue what the rules are, something might appear. Yeah, yeah, I think that would, that would be the best course of action. Alright, so then... Check out the stupid rules. Yeah. After turning on my e handbook, the first thing I appeared to do was my name. So just like Monokuma said, the owner's name showed up front and center. Then, from the main menu that popped up, I selected the school regulations icon. An itemized list appeared on screen. It was the school regulations. In other words, the rules being imposed on us all. Students may reside only within the school. Leaving campus is an unacceptable use of time. So they can't even enter outside? Like, is that what it's trying to... Students may reside only within the school. Leaving campus is not Damn, so yeah, so I guess they already thought if somebody even breaks out, then they already have, like, a rule for that. Nighttime is from 10 p.m. to 7 a.m. Some areas are off-limits at night, so please exercise caution. Sleeping anywhere other than the dormitory will be seen as sleeping in class and punished accordingly. With minimal restrictions, you are free to explore Hope Speaks Academy at your discretion. Violence against Headmaster Monokuma is strictly prohibited, as is destruction of surveillance cameras. Anyone who kills a fellow student and becomes blackened will graduate unless they are discovered. Anyone who kills a fellow student and becomes blackened will graduate unless they are discovered. Okay. Divisional school regulations may be added as necessary. So is this a thing where, like, they could just add more rules? Like, that's going to make shit even harder to do stuff then for, for the characters. Feeling a slight dizziness, I raised my face up from the screen. As I looked around, I saw the same stormy expression on everyone's face. Stop fucking around! Sorry, control. <laughs> Why don't we wander around the school without a care in the world and see what happens? Personally, I would love to see what happens when someone breaks one of the rules. However, but if we got punished like that we saw before, I don't think there'd be a respawn waiting. Yo. Well, the brother pounding this in the hand. When a man makes a promise, he has to keep it even if he kills. And. So put. What? We made a ton of promises, I saw the keep, so that's what. Piece of shit! Guess I can't afford to die. <sighs> None of that made much sense to me, but he's saying that you will follow the regulations. Is that. That's true. Well, I guess you're right. Um, Question for regulation number six. What do you think it means exactly? Yeah, anyone if, yeah, anyone who kills a student to become black. Yeah. Talking about the second half, right, where it says, unless they are discovered. I was wondering about that. Yeah, yeah, part of me was wondering about that, too. Hmm. It's saying that if you want to graduate, you have to kill someone without anyone finding out it was you. Ooh. Ooh, that's that's another interesting layer to it. Why, why do we have to do that? <laughs> I don't see any reason to worry about it. Just worry about following the rules that they've been explained. Such ignorance. I don't want to hear anything from someone who waits for others to decide what to do. <laughs> Give me a break. Yeah, I was... Mm. Yeah, I don't like him. Can he die? But for now, let's forget about the silly chunk of... Or okay. Now that we know about the rules, 
Let's start exploring the school. Hmm. So we need to find out where exactly we are. Is there any way out? What about food and supplies? You understand? There are tons of questions we get. Let's I agree. Do it. Damn straight. Okay, let's start with that. Hmm. What? Not why? That's a pretty stupid idea. Don't you think? Hmm. Someone here might have already started thinking about murdering all of us. Very staying, we should stay. We should stand around with each other in a mess to make it much easier. Uh, I mean, that, I, I mean, thinking. that's a good point. I can't, I can't, I can't blame them for that. That would never. What? Don't bother saying it couldn't happen. You can't deny the possibility. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I mean, he's got a point. I don't like him, but he got a point. That's why you all seized up with fear when that graduation was made clear to you. Except for my girl. She was like, she was level-headed. Don't put her in the same basket. <laughs> I, I mean, he's got a point. Uh, um... uh, he got a point. Hmm. In accordance with what I think is best for me. Just hold I mean, on. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna let you run off and do whatever. What? What? <laughs> he got a point, but I don't like him still. What? Such ignorance. Damn, he called him a plankton. So incident that they could possibly have any kind of influence on the town. So you're sure. fucking dead. <laughs> kick his ass. Yeah, I mean, kick it. I go for it. You shouldn't. Fight. What? Okay. <laughs> Just some goody, some kind of goody goody. <laughs> You want to throw down? <laughs> you think you are talking like that? You think you're... Oh my god. You son of a oh bitch! Oh my god. Sakura, save me. Wham. He punched me. And I flew back in a heap. It was like something straight out of a comic book. I didn't even see the punch coming. It was just thrown suddenly <laughs> right there in my face. One second, I'll stand there. Next, I was soaring through the air. Now I think about it, maybe I'd kind of forgotten the kind of people I've been trapped here with. My common sense had just stopped functioning. Being around all these ultimates has blown my fuses. So I guess I shouldn't be surprised it led to something that as absurd as this. I like how they're trying to also explain, like, the, the craziness. Like, the, how, that, how much that punch was. Like, I appreciate that. But I just lose track of that sense of reality. That was my last thought as my consciousness started to fade. Oh my god, before I finally cut out completely. And I finally opened my eyes again. What I saw was. Nguga! Where is it? As if it had become part of my daily routine, I woke up in yet another room I'd never seen before. Okay, so where is he now? You have now. You now have the access to the handbook menu. You can use this ch to to check a variety of information as you play. Open the handbook menu by pressing the X button. You can use this menu to check the school regulations and character info in the report card section. At certain points, map and truth bullets may not be available. Ooh. You can also save and load the game day data under the system section. Finally, press the back button to review the transcript. This records all permanent infos to use this to review comments from everyone involved. You whatever personal belong with what, what does he have on him? Apparently you can have a lot of stuff on him. Report card. So this is where you see all the character information. It's okay, what where is my girl? Where, where there there she is. Where I need more information. We <laughs> It has the breast measurements. <laughs> Come on. Oh my god. Is that for the guys too? Like, is that a... Okay, we got equality. We got equality. We got chest measurements for everybody. It's just not the girls. Okay. Okay, so it's just... Okay. Regulations. Review the rules. So there's only seven rules? Or six? Yeah, seven, uh, seven rules. Additional score related. Yeah, that, see, that, I feel like that's gonna, like, be exploited or something, where it's, like, you know, they're gonna do something that's, like, within the rules, but then they're gonna, like, like, say there's, like, a loophole, because they can just add things to make it even harder. 
I don't know, I got this feeling about it. It could be like that. This will record all statements and events as they unfolded. Prevent any tampering in each case. Damn. Uh, system session finally pressed the back button to review the transcript. Damn. This is, I mean, this is cool. Um, but yeah, to find out, like, what's... Review evidence and witness accounts you've made a record. Truth bullets. Like, you shoot someone and they'll, like, tell you, like, if they killed someone or not. Like, they'll have to, it's like the lasso of truth type of thing. I don't, I don't know. They have a camera when you're sleeping. Oh, my God. I hate the idea of someone watching me right now. We're not allowed to mess with the camera, so I better not touch it. It's a notepad. I guess the school must have given it to each one of them. So who carried them to the room? Some kind of lint roller. I guess we're supposed to clean up after ourselves. be a key to the room. My name is written on the keychain. Which... Which means it must be mine. Yeah? Yeah, it's his. So is that... Uh, press the Y button to observe the room. Okay, wait. I'm... Wait, wrong one. Uh, presence. So is that... Is that where we see? I thought maybe that would show like the. Okay. So we got a waste bin. Just an everyday trash can. I don't see anything. Trapdoor, hidden compartments. Oh. What? What's that? What the? Observation press Y. Right, so. I wonder if I. Because I have it on, like, the medium setting, I wonder if that's why I, I'm able to hit Y and, like, see different things to click on. I mean, maybe that's, like, the... I mean, if I had on the hardest, it wouldn't show that. I don't know. This would appear to be the bathroom. What? How... How do you... How could you lock the bathroom? Who did this? Who would lock the bathroom? Is that air conditioner? Some kind of monitor, okay. I mean, that's clearly a bed, but anything particularly strange, okay. Um, okay. Oh, wait, we've got this here, which was that. He's a paper hanging up on the wall, which says, Announcement for the headmaster. Each room's lock has been designed to completely protect against tampering or lock picking. Remaking an individual room key is quite troublesome, so please make sure to not lose yours. Your room comes furnished with a shower, but please note that the water is turned off at night time. Also, the bathroom in the girls' room includes a lock of their own. Finally, we prepared a small gift to each of you. For the girls, a sewing kit. For the boys, a tool kit. The sewing kit includes a map of the body's vital organs. One step. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, they're teaching them how to properly, you know, like, kill they're helping the f oh my god for the boys we strongly we believe a strong blow to the head with any of the tools should be ample don't think just feel let's all enjoy ourselves i crumbled up the sheet of paper and threw it in the trash don't throw it in the trash that might be important to know pick it up pick it out of the garbage P pick it out of the garbage all it's in the pa pick it up pick up the paper that might be important. I don't know. Save all the lint. All right. Well, I mean, we got a plant here. I guess. I guess. I think we looked at everything. But how do you get into the like? Can I get in the bathroom now? Because I got the key. This appears to be the bathroom. That's weird. Um, is that it for the room, or is there anything else? All right. You know what? We'll just. I already looked at that. Damn it, I just I just looked at that. No, I Alright, let's just uh, I guess back out of the shadow. Looks like this door leads outside, it's locked. Some of the rooms have locks, huh? What? 
I'm like, am I stuck in here? Like, what else can I look at? There's some kind of metal plate mounted here. Is it to keep us all trapped? Um. So how on earth do I? How on earth do I get out of here? For now, I should just look around. What? But I, I feel like I looked at everything. I mean, that's just the bed. What else? Let's kind of look at it. Oh, wait. Oh. I don't think I... No, not not that. The cupboards. Oh, chat, thank you. Thank you. Looks like there's something in the floor. Ooh, okay. It must be brand new. It's still in the shrink room. I don't need a really nice now. Right here. I think I'm starting to understand this room. Sleeping anywhere other than the dormitory will be seen as sleeping in class when you finish the course. This is my assigned dorm room. Someone must have carried me here after I fell unconscious, so that answers that question. Next question is, what's everyone else up to right now? There's only one way to find out, and that's to get out of here. Is there anything else in like... I keep going to the bed. Did, wait, did he say he hope it doesn't hurt the bed's feelings? Oh, I said it feels normal. Okay. What? How, what? I hope that didn't hurt the bed's feelings. What? Is there anything else in there that I can look at? Something in the drawer? I mean, yeah, there's a toolkit. Wait, but maybe the, the chair? Wait. Okay, what's well this this is the bathroom. Oh, it's not opening, I guess it's locked. Okay, can I like leave now? Because I got the toolkit? Okay. I rushed out of the room to meet up with all the others. But there was someone waiting for me there. It was like something out of an old TV show. Wham! Ah! Oh! Uh, Sayaka? <laughs> Sorry. Are you okay? I, I'm fine. I hope you're okay. <laughs> Sorry about that. It's like right out of like a classic, like typical anime show with that. Uh, are you hurt? <laughs> okay. You know how I look, but I've actually built some pretty good muscle jumping up and down on stage. That's good. Uh, you okay from that Mondo? <laughs> That's true. I got knocked out right in. I guess I revealed my lack of cool right in front of the game. Uh, oh. That's good. Oh, that th are we getting some love interest vibes? By the way, what are you doing? Uh, um. Oh. Okay. Um, listen. Well, if you're... Well, if you really are feeling better, I was hoping you'd come to the dining hall. You see? Uh, after you got out of everybody decided to go do their own thing. We decided it would be more efficient if we split up to investigate. So we agreed to get together later on and talk about what we find out. So does that mean it's almost like it's almost time to get back together? If that's what's going on, then of course I'll go with That's you. good. Good. I'll go on ahead and meet you there in the dining hall. Okay. Did 
copy it. <laughs> Looks like there's some kind of nameplate. Uh, looks pretty much the same. Damn, I thought I could get into the room. <laughs> It'd be funny if I could. Huh. Yeah, everybody's rooms are like, yeah, the same. There's anything. Is it just the same for everybody else then? If that's the case, then it will just move on our merry way. I'm being extra cautious. Well, I, I know, but I just, like, I want to explore a little bit, because I, I want to understand. This is going to drive people to, like, this environment. I'm assuming that's the girls one. Yeah, it is. It could... <laughs> I don't know. Okay. I am so stupid. I'm like, I forgot I have a map. So this should. Classroom and stuff. Oh, I don't have any of these. I should meet up with everybody in time. Wait, hold on. Make sure I know how to. Laundry there, got a bath there, got food there. I'm maybe that's um... huh? Okay, this would be a dormitory. Dining hall. Okay. Um... That's good. Yeah, okay. Um, is that right now with us being close here? Nobody was there waiting for us. We really don't have much choice. I guess we should just wait here. <laughs> okay. Ooh, like that. I said, I'm psychic. <laughs> <laughs> I like how it's self-aware. Uh, here comes the tutorial. Right now, I'd like to talk about reactions. So you're going to be talking to Sayaka, right? Well... While you're talking here, some purple words are going to appear. How, here's how they work. When purple words show up, if you press Y, it'll, you'll go into reaction mode. At this point, you can use the directional buttons to make a selection and the A button to confirm it. Also, when it comes to that dialogue, you can review whatever you talked about to look for more info. Talking to someone about things like this is called a reaction. Also, do your best to enjoy your ever playing school life. Reaction. Ah, you've got ahead news already. Well, that's just wonderful. Make sure you keep in mind as the story keeps on moving forward. Okay, so I guess when that pops up, I can try to do that again. Hey, um... I know this is kind of continuing the self-introduction thing, but I want to ask. Ooh, what? Huh. Uh, oh, but I, I feel like I'm going to be making a choice here that I'm going to regret, but I don't know. What's this mean? What did you want to ask? Hmm. If you happen to go to Blackout, or Blackroot Junior High. Maybe in 
class two. Yeah, I actually was. Oh, ah. I knew it. I went through two. I was in class four. Did you feel for me? Do I remember? Even back in middle school, she was a celebrity with all kinds of ultimateness surrounding her. How can I forget? Almost as surprising as her question was that she remembered me. Oh my God! We've been. We never talked to each other, but somehow she knew, still knew who I was. Hey, um. Huh. <laughs> we went to the same school for three years. Yeah, of course I remember. That's true. There are lots of students in that grade. Plus, I've never, I've never been a type of person who would stand out. I'm average at everything, and all my hobbies are totally normal. Even normal would call me. Uh -huh. What are you talking about? You're so strange. Strange. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. He losing them. He losing them. Those simp points started to giggle even louder. And somehow mysterious smiles for his made my heart glow grow call. Oh, that's cute. Her smile was the nicest smile I've ever seen. That's good. Anyways, I'm really glad that I know somebody here. <sighs> Talking to you has made me feel a lot better about all of this. You're amazing. No, I'm really not. I'm nothing compared to all of you old folks. <laughs> You're the one that helped me find my courage again. Not any of those old folks. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. And thank you for helping yeah, also going to become your ultimate. Oh my god, that's cute. Ultimate assistant. <laughs> I need your assistant. I'm going to help you out as much as I can, so let's get out of here together. We just, <laughs> we just be pumped up. Which is nice, but still, everyone else is still late. Besides that, I don't even know what time it is right now. There must be a clock around here somewhere. Yeah, I don't see a clock. What time is it right? Oh my god, it doesn't even say. Seven o'clock in the night. But it's just that there's no like hands though. Uh, um. Okay. Without being able, I've lost all sense of time. Oh no, that means he can't shower. Oh no, he gonna be stinky. I have to stay in this place for too long. I'm like, okay. Hey, um. Almost like he timed it out. Take it through, open the dining hall doors. Oh, okay. That's good. Hey! How unfortunate. Too bad. I was sure I could do it. I guess that means I don't have to fight him. Oh my god. Got it. Well, don't give up next time. I'll swear I'll win. Getting there early? No. I mean, <laughs> that's a bit. Yeah, yeah! I agree. I agree. And soon after that, everyone else came strolling in one after another. After a few minutes, everyone had gathered in the dining hall. Okay, it looks like everyone's here. Time to start the meeting. Let's all go around and share what we found out during our respective investigations. The sooner we find out what's going on, the sooner we get out of here. Hold on a sec. What are you talking about? Hmm... What about, uh, what's the name of the solar hair? <gasps> hmm. Oh. Oh, no. Oh. I took another look around the dining hall. Sure enough, she was nowhere to be seen. Um. I wonder where she went. I wonder if somebody had seen her. Don't, don't, don't play with my emotions. Where is she? Wait. <laughs> Came with simp for the right girl. Dish up their heads. Huh? So nobody's seen her. Why hasn't she? Could be because. Yes, indeed. You must kill us all. It's as simple as that. <laughs> the rest is up to you. Give it to your own sheep. Sheep. Hmm. Hmm. Reaching. Come <laughs> on. Check <Jackass>. yes. Mm. <laughs> what do you want me to do? Punctuality is everything. You hear me? Now then, I clear the first session of the book. Okay. Um. I've talked enough. Maybe we should listen to what everybody else has to say. <laughs> All right. <And> so. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Dappy Q. Dappy Q. <laughs> That'll give everything I got. Well, you've already done so much. 
That's key. So. Do I have to talk to everyone still? Wait. It's got. No! That. Um... Yeah, what's going on? Everyone spoke to a biscuit. You food. see? Ooh. Ooh. Reaction. Which one do I. I don't. That's, that's a little saucy. Listen to me! I made a discovery of century. I found there was exactly one room for each person. Uh, yeah. Huh. And plus. Scream your lungs out and you wouldn't hear a thing. <laughs> well, each room had a private bathroom which could also lie. She may be a liar, but I mean, that, she'd be true on that aspect, I think. Mm. Looked like there were only locks on the bathrooms. But when I checked my bathroom door before, it definitely seemed like it was locked. That's weird. I should double check that. Room. Hey, come on! They're assuming we're gonna be here. Quiet down and listen! I better. So you have and have not. At least we don't have to worry about surviving. <sighs> that can't be all we have to report on, can it? Got it! No, I was. Alright. What this. Yeah, I guess I already talked to him. Okay. I I just clicked um, on the same person again. Damn it! I. You see. All right, I already did him. Okay, what about him? Try to find some clue as to who's responsible for imprisoning this here. Unfortunately, it made no such discoveries. That's all. Hmm. <laughs> If I discover anything naturally, I would have more to say, but I didn't. Okay. Okay. Where is my Where is my girl? I'm I'm upset. Who else can I talk to? I don't think I should leave her. <laughs> I didn't mean to leave. I meant the other. I meant the other. No, I. Let's talk about somebody else. It's a TV right now, it's just showing a school press, even so. Hey, listen. <laughs> I was just gonna leave and not, like, <laughs> figure anything else out. Oh my god, no, I got I was trying to talk to someone. Got that camera there. Experience camera, I hate the idea someone's watching right now. I have to keep in mind that it's against school regulations and my I better leave it alone. Yeah. Oh. I wonder what those coins are. I mean I already looked at the time, so I don't know what that would really show. The, press the Y button. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. Um. You see. Okay, well we did both of those options, so I guess we can. Okay. All grouped up together. went up and down the school double checking the windows in all the hallways and classes we all want to see if we get yeah, this real place on what happened was hmm. nothing they couldn't get a single one to budge you know, what should I do school really has been totally cut. this is bad yeah bad 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 
Hey, come on. So let's progress um, a little more further. You see. We did that. We did that. Same group goes first. Alright, we'll go with those first. We thought maybe we could find some way to communicate with the outside, so we went looking all over. Sorry. Couldn't find a thing. Yo! Going back to the main hall thinking maybe we could do something about the giant hunk of metal. What? 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 Me both. Damn. I guess that's very telling of how absolutely strong that stuff is. A big muscular soccer could do it. We hit it with desks and chairs and nothing. <laughs> Shit. Yes, indeed. <sighs> oh, this sucks. I have to. You have to manage your hydration. So then. Tell you what happened next. It has nothing to do with communicating with the outside world, but still worth worrying about. In both the school and the dorm areas, there was a set of stairs leading up to the other floor. But... It's here. We couldn't find any way to open them, so we couldn't check it out. Hmm. In other words, at this point, we are only able to search the first floor. However, we can further assume that there is potentially something above the second floor as well. And if that's the case, there is at least a chance. May lead to a way out. Good point. Um, okay. you see. All right, let's get their input on it. Let's see. Can't say we acted as one. Rather, we did nothing as one. <laughs> Spent the entire time in the gym. Most unfortunate. You're not exactly the types to go around in a school like a gag what you need. The hell's wrong with you? <laughs> <laughs> oh no. She 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 be tweaking. She gonna be having problems, I swear. I'm calling it. Feels like it's just it's just gonna happen. What the If you wanna go with someone else, you should just says something. <laughs> go anywhere. Oh my god! <laughs> Damn, that's a burn. So, <laughs> your mind as is, uh, finish your body. <laughs> Make me sick. Oh Are you for God. real? Hey, come on. Uh. <laughs> oh my God. I don't think that's. Hey, what's going. um. So that's what they have to say, huh? I guess I'm the only one left. Found the fridge in the back of the kitchen. It was overflowing with all kinds of stuff. That's good. Guess we don't have to worry about food at least. Okay. What? So how long could as? Yeah, I think mean, it's a good question. <laughs> Eat sesame seed. <laughs> Parakeet. <laughs> I don't think I have to worry about that. All the food gets restocked automatically each day. Um... At least that's what my cook said. Uh -huh. You saw him. Okay. Yeah, he came out of nowhere else checking the fridge. He told me that and then disappeared. He was so fast, I can't believe someone could have been moving around. Been moving him around with a remote control. That's. I hope a nice toy that could just appear out of nowhere. I can't tell if we're supposed to be. But. Is everything okay? He didn't try to, like, eat you or anything? He did What do you mean by that? I mean, he said he was kind of. Oh my god. Oh my god, stop! No, not that kind! <laughs> hey, you bastard! <laughs> yeah, that's a kind of sleazy choice. Actually, I like that's a good. No, that's hey! <laughs> Prisoners here, we can't just. We could all just die nice. <laughs> Shit. Can't be making. I gotta do something or a voice cut through the noise, interrupting. Yelling and carrying on. Hmm? If you really think you can afford to do so, have some to accept the dirt. <laughs> she didn't say a word. Instead, she just dropped a piece of paper on the table. It appears to be a map of Hope Peaks Academy. Ooh. Wow. It doesn't matter what. She's being sussy! 
What? What is it? I need. I need the answers. What the heck? It does matter. I freak this out. But more important, what does it, mean? it would seem. Just look at it. The building they're in right now is laid out precisely the same way. So. Okay. Yeah. It's true. In terms of construction, yes. It looks like it's had a number of strange renovations done to it. However. I don't know all the details yet. All I found was the details about the first floor. Um. But this is really hopes peak. We didn't get kidnapped and taken to some other place. Okay. Huh? Yeah, that's true. I wonder about that. But. Well, I think those are. The <sighs> Let's stop talking about all this. You know, stuff. Aren't you worried? This. Uh, this Yo. Seriously worried about what? This is all planned out, right? The people in charge of host peak put this all together. <laughs> if I got stressed every time something like this happened, I'd have <laughs> Oh my god. You know? Good, good things come to those who wait, right? So we just got chill and everything will work this up. <laughs> What's your problem? <laughs> I'm just happy. I see splitting up to investigate was a good idea after all. <sighs> Maybe she's thinking it's a bad idea after all. I gotta be suspicious with that. You're listening, looking around with a total waste of time. See? That's what I was thinking. Like, which, the things she says, it's like, it's like the opposite of what it means. We didn't find a way out. And didn't find who's behind it, so we just have to find a Oh! It's not crystal clear to, to you, what's going on. Are you okay with this? Is it? It is perfectly obvious that we've been in prison and subsequently no way out. None of us had any response to that. We didn't want to accept that reality, but it was starting to. Yeah, it's gonna, it's gonna start driving people. See, it's gonna. She got. She already be tweaking. I know it. I got feet. I, I just know it. I'm just saying that I was trying not to think about. No way, we're trapped. What are we supposed to do? It's very simple. If you want to leave, you just have to kill. Stop it! What are you doing? Be jumping up down. Um, Everyone, just calm down. And just stop thinking about what we do. Seems like. There's gotta be something we can do. <laughs> All we can do is adapt. Adapt to living our lives here. Nope. Nope. I, I, I don't believe that. That's... That's not what she feels like. Live here, he's saying we should be successful. Do you understand? <laughs> the lack of adaptability is a, is, is a lack of survivability. Survival is not based on those, on who is the strongest or smart. It comes down to who can adapt. Actually. Someone who's come out and taught more than once. I have to... What? Hmm. We all understand that we're trapped here, which means we will be spending the night forever. Do I remember the rule regarding nighttime, right? You can't shower! You can't shower at night, and that sucks. Nighttime. <laughs> can't, can't shower at night. <laughs> Why is that the first thing on my mind? Nighttime is from 10 p.m. Some areas are off limits at night, so please exercise caution. So maybe things, maybe there's more things open in daytime. Sleeping anywhere other than the dormitory will be seen as sleeping class and be punched for Okay, so you just can't just sleep randomly. Let's see. So guarding this nighttime, I think we need to add a rule of our own. <laughs> Going out at nighttime should be prohibited altogether. That might be true. That might be true. School regulations do not actually tell us not to go out at night. I would like to make that official. Huh? Why? Are you okay with this? The way things are now, every time night comes, we will all start to get more anxious. Mm -hmm. We'll all be afraid if someone will try to come to us. <laughs> if we have to worry about that night after night, who knows how long the war is gone. I see. So you're suggesting we limit our activity at night as a kind of preventative measure? Indeed. Yeah. However, unlike other rules, nobody can be forced to comply. We don't have to agree to fall. What True. can we do? But she go break it. Wait, no. That wouldn't make it. Because then... I don't... I don't I'm, thinking, I'm thinking it. See what you mean? I, but I think I can agree to that. Yeah? Well, just just sleep. I mean, you'll only have to be up for like, I think, two hours, then you can nap, and then you can be able to... You know, I mean, that's not... I mean, that's not bad. But then again, if you want you want the midnight munchies, then you're kind of screwed. But 
You have to get that in, in advance. That's that's the price to pay. Without something like that, we're just gonna self-destruct. Good point. Good point. Listen to me! Half all the men here, I agree to comply. What? Can't just decide. This is fine. So everyone's in agreement. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, let's see. It's almost nighttime. I want to take a shot. No, you can't. That's the thing, isn't it? Like, you can't do it. I hope you are well. She's lying. I, I got a feeling. I got a feeling she'd be lying. She's gonna be doing something. Cause I, I thought you're not supposed to shower at night. could imagine. I don't know. She's the queen of liars for a reason. I'm not going to believe it. I don't know if I meant that. <laughs> Her behavior seems to I could imagine anyone trying to stop me. Uh, where do we go from here? We'll be spending the night with huh. Adaptability. Hmm. So, Mr. Chairman, what's next? One person I want. Hmm. Um, well then, what can we... Let's say we call an end of today's mission. You understand? It's almost like Timmy. We can, uh, recon, uh, reconvene, reconvene that first and foremost. Huh? We have to stay the night. Oh, what no. can we do? Get some snacks. Oh, this sucks. We had after <sighs> That's just fine and good for today, but what do we do tomorrow. So in the end, <laughs> our only option is to split up and look around again. And let everybody know if we find anything. Hmm. Yeah, okay, let's do that. Aww. Are we done for today? Good. With heavy, heavy movements, everybody headed off to their private rooms. Um. Are you ready to call it a day? Sure. Is this really going to be staying for the foreseeable future? Oh, that's right. I should check the bathroom one more time before I go to bed. Only the girls' bathrooms should have locks on them, right? Go to that bathroom. Alright, let's go. Huh. Bzz. Huh. Holy crap. Hmm. Talk about an overreaction. It's like you just saw a ghost or something. Wah -wah? That's some kind of robot bear. Go. What are you doing? What? Super duper majorly bad, so bad it's almost magical. What? Ultra magical off <laughs> uh -huh. point of point of fact, I acknowledge that the bathroom in your room has a problem with the door frame. Like, so the reason I want to open isn't because it's locked, it's just the door doesn't it just doesn't fit. Hey! Um Didn't you see the notice? I can't you read the bathroom? The bathrooms in the boys' rooms don't have locks. Yeah. <laughs> Lock on a boy's back. It's kind of pointless to me. Ba -bum, ba -bum. Huh. Oh my god. Who would who would make out in the bathroom? That's a... <laughs> I don't... Listen up! It's a little trick to open this particular ill-fitting door. And that's why I'm here to teach you. Okay, already. If you just gotta turn a doorknob, then lift up while you pull. Turn it and pull up. Okay. Yes indeed! Turn the knob and lift. Alright. And I did that, the door opened without a problem. <laughs> See, open right up. Isn't it crazy though? Your door's the only one that doesn't. Oh, isn't that cute? Isn't that cute how the door isn't. is. is not normal? Wait, I don't know what I was trying to say. It's like the game is saying that this character doesn't fit. Quite right in this element compared to everybody else. Isn't that <laughs> it's supposed to be the ultimate lucky student, right? But it looks like you're not. Oh, that's. Bye fair. bye! Anyway, I suddenly don't feel like being here anymore. Anyway. What the f. Damn it. Did I miss my chance? Hmm. For something. <clears throat> school announcement it is now 10 p.m no i can't shower no as such it is officially night time no i can't shower soon the doors to the dining hall will be locked and entry at that point is strictly prohibited well that sucks okay then 
Sweet dreams, everyone. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Looks like it's nighttime. We all promised we wouldn't leave our rooms now. All we can do now is try to get some sleep. While still mumbling to myself, I collapse into bed. My eyes close almost immediately. It's not that I was ready for bed exactly. I was just utterly exhausted. It was as if I spent the entire day staring at TV watching movies. Or some kind of illusion where I've been tossed into a made-up fantastical world. Ooh. This is how the curtains closed my first day. Soon enough, I was asleep. It would be home. It would be too much to hope that when I woke up, I would realize it was all true. It's kind of lame as far as endings go, but I'd be fine. But actually, I'd be fine. I can't believe it. Jay, so he, so he purposely talked to me for a long time because to make me not shower. That's fucked up. Hygiene is important. Even though I only do it once a year. <laughs> it's kind of lame as far as but behind what they actually be for the best. If any normal school, Mr. McClellan, Mono Puma would be a kind teacher, but when I think about what's coming up, I'm just so full of pride and joy. Our ceremony earlier today was absolutely splendid. Thank you all very much. Remember, you're all students at Host Peak Academy and strive to refine your ideals. I swear to you, I will send you all off into a new tomorrow! Good morning, everyone! It is now 7 a.m. and nighttime is officially over! Time to rise and shine! Get ready to greet another beautiful day! But we can't go outside. That's, that's... A... Apparently it's morning, but thanks to the total lack of windows, there's no way to know. Yeah, that's true. Anyway, what should I do now? Shower! Find some... No, you gotta shower! You're, you're stinky! Figure out where to go from here. No, shower! Okay, it's a side. No, you gotta shower first! With a newfound room, I left my room. No, you're supposed to shower first! Get back in that room! Get back in that room, you gotta shower. Shower. I swear to God. <laughs> shower. Absorb. Have to make sure you remember the trick to opening it. No, you gotta. Ah, you gotta shower first! God damn it. Damn. Why, well, Wanda? Oh, I, I wanted to. I wanted to save the game. It was actually. I like to definitely end the stream here because this this game has piqued my interest. It's I'm usually not like a big fan of like 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 students in a school type of setting because I just think it's kind of played out. But this had, definitely has a nice little twist to it with this element in here. I'm very intrigued to play more of this though. I I really like where this is going. I like her. I like her a lot. So, what's her name? I gotta, I gotta remember the name. Kyoko. I like her. All right. 
So with that said, I think we'll just wrap the stream up here for tonight. Thank you everybody for tuning in. Camera rolling with the ten dollars though. Again, I really, I really much appreciate it. People tuning in, watching something that's completely far removed from anything I do. I had a belch. But, yeah, this says peak my interest. I'm, I'm looking forward to playing more of this. So, yeah. I'm going to get going here. Thank you, everybody, for tuning in. I will I will hopefully stream more of this or something because this has been pretty entertaining. So, yeah. Either way, um, that'll do it for me. I will see you all in another thing. But, um, yeah, take care. Dang it. My mouse can't. I have to do this and then bring the mouse over. So that's a little annoying. Yeah, because it disappears if I don't do that. But, yeah, that'll do it for me. Take care. Have a good night, and I'll play more of this game because this has been pretty